spanning 91 kilometers. The ongoing reconstruction of Oshobo Iwoibada Road commenced in October 2022 as a joint project of Oyo and Oshun State Government. The 11.3 billion naira project is expected to span a year and six months, having paid 30% of the budget to the handlers. However, it seems to be moving at a slow pace. Sequel to the scrutiny of the contractor on the floor of the house, the on-the-spot assessment by a six-man adult committee constituted by the Oshun State House of Assembly became necessary. The team led by the Deputy Speaker Aki Yodui Wusi wanted to know the cause of the delay of the project. Looking at the economic and infrastructural development of the road pertains for the state, the House is worried if the contractor will be able to meet the 2024 completion date. According to the uh, uh, Ministry of Works, the job is 20% is done, so we believe it can still at least try its best to make it faster. We have crossed over 20%, at 20.1%. We have done earthworks, we have done the, uh, the cutting of the embankment, we have done asphalt laying, we have done scarification, we have done the stone-based laying. Uh, those are done. We are doing the drainage now, we have done coffered extension and all the rest. Those critical sections that have normally caused the failure on this road, we have been able to address them. And in the next couple, we can start. Some areas just need overlay, uh, laying of asphalt that does not take time. And uh, we are also entering the dry season now, and uh, the work will be faster now, because these are the basic foundations that we need to do. The coming in of the House of Assembly has uh, already made a difference, and we are happy about that, because part of their oversight function is what they have done today, and what they have been doing, doing before. We're happy about it. This has made a lot of difference. The other committee is expected to brief the assembly on their findings on the Oshobo Iwo Ibad Road. In Oshobo, Joshua Kuchire, NG News.